In this video, we will be talking about Rosenmund reduction. And as the name suggests, this particular reaction is the reduction reaction. So basically, alkyl, sorry, acyl, chloride undergoes reduction, okay, in the presence of palladium and barium sulfate as the catalyst. And this leads to the formation of the reduced product and we'll here get aldehydes. And hydrochloric acid. So here acyl chloride is undergoing reduction in the presence of palladium and barium sulfate as the catalyst to form aldehyde as well as hydrochloric acid. So let's take two examples. One where you have, so first of all, acyl chloride is R. Okay, I'll write it down here, it's better. So R C O C L. Okay, and this R group can be an alkyl group or it can also be an aromatic ring. So it can be a benzene ring as well. So we'll start with taking the benzene ring. So benzyl chloride reacts with hydrogen, palladium and barium sulfate to lead to the formation of benzaldehyde and hydrochloric acid. And another example, we are taking CH3COCl reacts with, I mean, gets un undergoes reduction in the presence of pal palladium and barium sulfate to lead to the formation of ethanol plus hydrochloric acid. And here in this reaction, we will add something else, sulfur or quinoline. Now, generally what happens is aldehydes can further get, un I mean, further get reduced to form primary alcohol to make sure that these do further undergo reduction and from primary alcohols something called a poison is added okay so these poisons in this case is sulfur or quinoline and these prevent the over reduction of the aldehyde to give us a primary alcohol so we don't want this reaction to proceed and for us to get a ch3 ch2oh because that will form but because we add a reagent like this one which is called a poison so we are poisoning the reaction material and this makes sure that the reaction stops at aldehyde so the rosenman reduction is a re reduction reaction where an, where an acyl chloride is reacting or undergoing reduction in the presence of palladium and barium sulfate as the catalyst to form an aldehyde and a hydrochloric acid and we've had two examples one where this is an aryl group here it's an alkyl group uh, we are adding sulfur or quinoline as a poison over here this makes sure that the aldehyde further does not get reduced to give us a primary alcohol with that we're done with rosenman reduction the next one we'll be learning about stephen reaction do check it out